So like its predecessors before it, gaming is essential to all modern smartphones. And the Galaxy S5 also has to, of course, face our tests for gaming on the S5. So we've used it for a while. We've actually been gaming throughout the night with it, but we wanted to just um, show you and give you our thoughts on what gaming is like in terms of battery, how we handle games, and also you can take a look and see. So we're going to take a look at a few games here. We have Frontline 2, um, CR, CSR Classics, Shooter, Overkill 2, Modern Warfare, Modern Combat 4, and Real Racing 3, and He-Man. So let's start off with Modern Combat 4 and see how well that handles. So. We're also going to leave the audio up so you can hear the sound from the speakers, which are the back. The one thing I'll tell you, the speakers and the way it's been modernized for the S5 is that it's got now that um, almost like rumble vibration feedback. So when, you know, when sounds pop, it actually rumbles across the back plate here. So it feels like you're getting more bass out of it altogether. And let's continue from where we stopped. Lieutenant, air support is limited until you destroy those anti-aircraft vehicles. After that, move to extraction. Copy that, mate. Come on, mercenaries taking VIP hostages. Yeah, right after everything that went down in Seattle and Moscow. Shit.
Shouldn't we go to the police? Frank's trying to kill me. The cops are on Frank's payroll, just like the rest of this town. Just drive, kid. We'll worry about Frank later. So we've done some uh, gaming on our Galaxy S5, and I can tell you it handles the games very well. You could hear, first of all, the sound of the speakers is actually quite good. And I thought it, you know, it won't be as loud because it's at the back. You also got all that water uh, proofing or water resistance and all that fun stuff in there. But you can still hear your games quite clearly. Now, in terms of the processing, it has an 801 processor, so the games should run. All games should run very well unless it's not optimized properly. Uh, heat uh, dissipation of the device it, it there is some heat but it's very light it's probably it feels just um, just a little bit warm and what I mean by warm it just kind of like it's almost like you just doing applying pressure and heat to the to you to the device itself now some games of course will task the, the processor harder than others so for instance um, um, the, uh, the the Vegas type game we played, I just even forgot the name right now, um, right here, which would be Las Vegas, um, Gangster, sorry, Gangster 4, um, basically uh, that game um, was more tasking than any other game that we played uh, played on the system. So that one actually made it warm up a little bit more and caused more battery drain. Now the battery drain is, is fine with this, except that's the only game I, I've experienced so far that really tasked the system and brought it down but uh, for the most part you will, will lose about maybe 20% uh, of your battery life while gaming with this so make sure your, your battery is fully charged but the S5 handles very well I like its gaming performance I think you know, uh, Samsung's gone, done a good job. I like the fact that the device is also light. It feels light and comfortable, so it doesn't feel heavy while gaming. I can literally hold this. And I will say that this uh, 
the faux faux leather with the polka dots uh, at the back actually feel a little bit more grippy which allows me to hold it better while gaming so uh, that's it if you have any questions any comments you can see my battery is pretty much dying here uh, let us know uh, don't forget to subscribe to all our pages on Twitter Facebook and YouTube uh, this is Thunder E saying thank you and always enjoy your entertainment